All right, guys, Gemini back with another video. I attempted to make this video yesterday um, about Harley Race, and it got stuck in Processing World. Never uploaded correctly, and so I just got tired of waiting for it to upload. Over 24 hours, and YouTube didn't process it. But this isn't about YouTube. This is about um, Harley Race passing away. Uh, Harley Race, wow, uh, a legend, a bruiser, a legit badass i mean harley race is the kind of wrestler who could uh put you on the mat and hurt you and that's that's what he did he was no joke in the ring he was uh vader's manager wcw managed vader at all those world titles uh you know he did the king you know harley race and wwf did the humiliation match with junkyard dog wrestlemania 3 march the 29th 1987 93,173 fans in the Pontiac Silverdome. You know, Harley Race was uh, in Ric Flair's spot before Ric Flair became uh, the NWA World Heavyweight Champion in the 80s. You know, Harley Race was there in the 70s, and Harley Race drew money, and uh, he was a, just a great, great technician in the ring, and he was just a big, mean bully in the ring. My childhood memories of him just being just terrified watching some of the stuff that he would do in there. I was just, I was just like so blown away by everything about the guy. I just hated him and I was so scared of him, you know, as a young child, not knowing any better, but Harley Race was scary. And uh, if you watch that match with Flair at Starcade 83, he really gave Flair a, a, a pounding, a beating in that match. He probably beat the shit out of Flair for 15, 20 minutes straight before, you know, he did the honors and dropped the belt to Flair in Greensboro in November of 83 at Starcade. But a race was a legend. Um, he would just destroy so many of the, the kids today wrestling. He was just, I mean, he was a true legend. Um, Sue bad and I never got a chance to meet him at a WrestleCon or something like that. I wish I would have. He shook his hand and just said thank you. And I think Harley's going to be missed by the wrestling world. A lot of people aren't going to remember him because he was, you know, out of competition by the early 90s. And we're going back 25, 30 years before, he, you know, he did his last match. But, uh, you know, he's he's gone, but he's not forgotten. I'm always going to remember Harley Race for his stuff with uh, Ric Flair. And I'm always going to remember Harley Race doing the humiliation match with Junkyard Dog at WrestleMania 3. I'm always going to have great memories of Harley Race and being a seven-time NWA World's Heavyweight Champion and... I have so much respect for him having the guts to be the champion in the NWA in the 70s. And um, he was just a, a legend of all legends. And unfortunately, as we get older, we're watching a lot more of our legends of wrestling fall. But I think he's universally respected. In fact, I know he's universally respected. And I'll never forget the name Harley Race uh, for the rest of my life. So you guys take care. Thank you for watching.